welcome guys in our talent open studio tutorial in this tutorial we are going to focus uh, that how can we remove a, a string from a, a string or some special character from a text so how can we do that so there are n number of transform transformation basically uh, you can use tmap or t replace uh, transformation in talent so uh, for example we have like this we have a data having three columns name favorite count and full text so so first of all in a name you can see there are two question marks and same in the full text also if there uh, there is two question marks then we have to remove it so we are going back to our open studio and create a new job like talent replace example okay and finish it Uh, so our blank job has been created now to make a connection so I have already make a connection to my file like edge now and here you can see this is the file connection uh, and uh, name favorite count full text are the common thing in my file okay then finish it okay okay now what I need to do here I need to just drag and drop this metadata file delimited connection on the job okay and uh, I have to choose the file input delimited okay because I am using CSV so this is the best component okay now after that I need to use tmap tmap component tmap process component and this is very useful component to which allows joins column or row filtering transformation and multiple output so here we are going to use tmap processing as a transformation purpose okay now just connect our input source to tmap now double click on tmap now you can see i need to just create a data set uh, that is my output so that is user tweets okay now i have created this now just copy these columns like and bring into output set so in a name so what I need to do here in a name just click on it and now you can see what I need to do here I need to replace dot replace now you can see this is the replace and you can say replace all and replace yeah so I am going to use replace okay now what I need to uh, replace quotes and replace with blank space okay and same for the full text okay and click on ok now go to the full text also and use the replace and passing the same condition over here and single double quotes blank ok and click on ok button and now apply these changes and click on ok so 
so guys we we have made all the necessary changes so i am going to show you so in the team app double click on it it will open the row input column and output column so output column we have created a user tweets and in expression in the, in the name we are using replace function for the text uh, full text we are using the replace so what i did here now you can see that uh, you can test and test it also over here again now i'm going to test it okay null and for okay so we have done all the changes to replace double question marks to blank okay now apply it and okay now after that i need to watch the data so i am going to use t log display the t log row okay now here uh, what i need to do here i'm just right click on it t map and choose user tweets okay now double click on t log now you can see there is a mode schema uh, first of all schema in basic setting so in edit schema you can see these are the column we are using the same data set and fill separator is pipe so we are going to choose table print value and now we are going to run this package okay now you can see that uh, in the data there is no double question mark in the name but uh, you can see there are some question mark but there are more species okay in the name so it is very easy to use a tmap component transformation to replace a string or you can use replace or replace all so we are going to show you replace all also so guys in our next video we are going to show you how to use replace all function in tmap component transformation so here you can set the number of rows also so i am going to set the line limit as 50 and re-execute this job also okay so you can see this is the output and if you want to remove any other or replace any other characters so you can also do that so here in basic setting what i need to do i am going to clear this and in t log so what i need to do is uh, that is basic and mode i am going to tabular format and in basic print header so there are many more settings which can be applied to the data output so if i am going to choose basic so i am just select print header and rerun the job okay now you can see this is the output if that is a simple mode if i am going to use as a tabular format then data would be display in a tabular format so now you can see it is very easy to replace a string in a in talent open studio so guys please subscribe my channel on youtube